In this video, we will show you the setup and installation of your new X7 Reverse Osmosis Drinking Water System. For the accessories, please refer to the list in the manual to make sure no parts are missing. If you have any question about the instructions or the product you received, feel free to reach out to us. We will begin with the setup of feed water tubing. Close the water supply valve, then turn on the kitchen faucet to release water pressure. Make sure no water is coming out before moving on to the next step. Next, locate the cold water pipe connected to the water supply valve and simply unscrew it with an adjustable wrench. Locate the other end of RO water adapter with a pull buckle and insert the white 3 8 inch tube into the adapter. Place the washer on it and screw the cold water pipe to the adapter. Make sure to use the adjustable wrench to tighten the pipe. Be advised, if the cold water pipe is not quarter inch, you might want to use the tubing converter from the pack to connect. Connect the water supply valve to the RO water adapter. Place the washer in between and tighten up with the adjustable wrench. Keep the RO feed water adapter in the close position until installation is finished. Then connect the other end of the tube to the feed water port on the system. Make sure you have an existing hole available on the counter. If not, please refer to another video on our channel to drill a hole on the counter. First, take out the upper cap and mounting washer from the accessory pack. Screw them to the faucet rod, then insert the rod into the hole on the counter. Under the sink, place the bottom cap on the faucet rod, then screw the nut to the rod to tighten up the faucet. When the faucet is set, place the quick connect fitting at the end of the rod. After that, push the blue quarter inch PE into the other end of the fitting. At last, connect the blue PE tube to the port marked with pure water on the system. The drain saddle can fit into any one and a half inch straight length of pipe before the P-trap. Mark a preferred location of drain saddle with a pencil. Use the power drill with quarter inch drill bit to drill a hole on the mark. Be careful to only drill one side of the pipe. Take the front plate with the foam gasket on it and put the back plate together on the pipe and tighten the plates with screws and nuts evenly. Then attach the black quarter inch tube to the front plate and push the tube into the hole you drilled. Connect the black quarter inch tube to the wastewater port on the system. Plug the cable of the water leakage protector into the leakage protector port on the system. Tear off the double sided tape on the protector and place the protector on the ground near the system. Turn on the water supply valve and the RO feed water adapter. Connect the DC cable to the power port and plug in the power. The system will automatically start flushing for 45 seconds. Turn on the RO faucet. Let the faucet run for 30 minutes to flush out the protective liquid in the RO filter. A slow water flow is normal at the beginning. Pay close attention to each joint of the system during the flushing process. Make sure all tubing is installed correctly and there is no leakage at any joint, fitting, valve, or PE tube connection. Now the RO drinking water system is all set and ready to bring you pure, healthy drinking water in your own home.